Hi Libra, this is Tanya Lee of Harmonia Tarot and welcome to your July 2020 love reading. This reading is about how you feel, how your partner or significant other, the person you're thinking about feels, and then the combined energy. So it's three spreads, guys, okay? If you are new to this channel and you feel guided, go ahead and hit subscribe. Make sure you hit that bell twice so that you can be notified of all future updates. Just a reminder, this is still a general reading and time is fluid. So this might have um, happened to you already. Others of you, it's happening now. Others down the road. And that since it's a general and it's trying, trying to read, you know, for the masses, <laughs> that everything's going to resonate, guys, okay? So I really ask of you to utilize your own intuition to take what resonates, leave the rest. If it resonates more on one side, then just flip it. And if it doesn't, that just means the reading's not for you. If you want something more private and personable, go in that description box below. All of my information is there with my packages and services and how to get a hold of me so we can set up a private reading. Also, want to point out, this is a premiere. It is not a live. I appreciate you all tuning in for the premiere. And I also want to say, um, especially for those of you who have been donating as of late, especially using the super chat feature for the premieres. Um, thank you. Thank you for all your donations. I, they're so appreciative and I go, they go literally straight to this channel. So I use it for new cards and to support the channel's growth. Okay. And if you want to um, send a donation, not through super chat, you can also go in the descript description box below and my PayPal donation information is there too. Okay. Libra, are you ready? You ready to get started? Here we go. <laughs> Calling in our guides, our ancestors, and our ascended masters as to what messages in love do we hear, need to hear for July 2020? How is Libra feeling? How is the person that they're thinking about feeling? Or significant other or partner? Here we go. Wishing well. It's on your side. Heal the ouch is reversed. wishing well your wish your hope your desires <sighs> there is something that you are looking and trying to manifest somebody is wearing a mask though do you see how there's a mask that's floating i feel like it's the person that you're thinking about or on this other side somebody is wearing a mask somebody is wearing a mask somebody is disguising themselves or they have not opened up yet okay now they have heal the ouch Libra, I noticed here that this raccoon is like taking care of this fox who's sly or witty. I feel this is the energy of you. I feel like this is the energy of you taking care of things. You might be a healer or a healthcare worker or somebody who just is there for people. You know, like it could be a counselor or teacher or life coach or mentor or psychologist. Like there's so many different forms you can be as a, as a healer, as a light worker. But I do feel like your tendency is to heal, to heal and make sure people are okay. This person's head looks like it's hurting. It looks like you're there for this person. But with it reverse, this person <laughs> needs to do some self-healing. This isn't, I'm hearing this is not your job to heal this individual. Interesting. Let's see what the combined energy is. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm laughing. Nurturing? Nurturing. Gaia, nurturing. What did I just say? It's not your job to provide this healing for this. So listen, you're a very nurturing person. Okay, I can I can feel it already. I mean, you're definitely a very nurturing person. Libras, I mean, we can be. We're very we like to listen to the truth. And I'm saying weeks. I'm a Libra too. But and I got a lot of Libra in my chart. But it's this energy of feeling like you're constantly nurturing. And so this is this is a lesson because this person needs to learn to nurture themselves and take care of themselves. And they also have this desire to nurture too. Okay. So it's interesting. Let's see what additional messages we have on this. Family. You might already have a family with this individual or your desire or your wishes to have a family with this person. Little children. 
on their side like I said you might have children with this individual or this person might this might be a mixed family too so they might have children on their side so that's a lot of their priority or they might be dealing with inner children work meaning their inner child there's something that they have to heal in their child here okay family little children it, feel, it feels like this unity of like family heavily on your mind or you might have a family with this individual already for some of you. Let's see what the cards, the tarot cards have to say. You know what's funny? With the little children, you see how it's like drops? Like it's like rain coming in there with drops. It's like a ripple effect. This, there's sadness here like I feel like this person's almost crying about something or like feels a really deep sadness fortune fortune's wheel is on your side the ten of fire Wow the ten of earth that is a lot of tens like you literally just got three tens on your side wait till you see like what completions here oh my gosh they too have a 10 on their side because they have the sun. <laughs> Let me show you that because it comes to a 19. We have the seven of water reversed and we have the queen of water. We have the two of earth on the joint energy and we have the ace of air reversed with the star reversed. Interesting. Fortune's wheel, a 10. Major arcana here. I feel like you know that something is changing about this relationship. I feel that you are already aware that this person is doing self-healing, is working on themselves. I think though that you might feel like they might put other people a priority before you. I do feel like you're low in the totem pole. This doesn't necessarily make you feel like, because there, I, I mean there's family and children involved here. So it does feel heavily like there's family in, involved or family is the priority or this person might just have a lot of friends or you know people who take his attention or her attention away okay like it feels like this person has a lot of attention that they're like constantly like they you're not really there like you're not a priority okay how you feel with the ten of fire you could be dealing with an aries leo or sagittarius is like you see all this opportunities and if they're just burning it feels overwhelming okay it's like you're looking at your list and it's like okay well this was my wish but this is not exactly the wish that I desired. I desired to be with this person to love and to be in a nurturing relationship. I feel like I'm constantly like picking up the pieces. You might be picking up the pieces because you are a healer, but you realize that this person needs to, I hear, get their stuff together. 10 of earth. This is definitely another family card here. Abundance, happiness, but like feeling that security. Earth energy here, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus. Listen, you're on your own though animal is that oh that's a wolf you're on your own but you got a wolf here so this there is loyalty here this person is when I see wolves or dogs it's about loyalty this person is loyal to you this person is protective of you I hear protective you see this in this individual but it's like you're kind of like can you stop protecting and look at me I'm hearing can you stop like turn around and look at me I'm right here but this person is like not nurturing themselves okay now on their side there's that 10 I mean you've got three tens on your side I mean there's completion here um, yes they see you and this is family too they 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 see you as family they want to they want this family they want to I think they actually want to extend the family right um, they know that they've been wishy-washy. There have been a lot of illusions with the seven of waters is confusion. This is reverse. They are not confused about how they feel about you. Okay. They feel about you as the queen of water. Okay. And this, you, you know, the queen is just, you know, feminine energy, but this is somebody who's passionate, loyal, loving, empathetic, sympathy. I just feel like you're a healer. So to some aspect, you are a healer, very like nurturing, compassionate, you go with the flow. People are attracted to you. The two of earth is on your combined energy. Feeling the juggle. Feeling the strain of the juggle. Okay? I think you both feel this. I think that you both are feeling the current of like, oh my gosh, when are we going to nurture this relationship? The ace of air is wanting to see the truth. But I do feel like someone is wearing a mask because it's reverse. So it's telling me that some kind of communication is not happening, okay? It's not allowing this situation because the star is about 
it's as much as it, people think it's a wish or a hope or desire, right? Because you got the wishing well as well. But like to me, and what it really means is healing. You guys are, are learning to, to heal, okay? Fill your own cup, right? Fill your own cup here, okay? This is reverse. The healing is not done. I feel that you are aware that this person is not ready to, to, be, to, to, to nurture you in this relationship. And what you're doing about it is, I don't, I don't think you're waiting. I think you're just like, you realize that this connection is something strong, but there's a wish that you, you desire that this person will make you a priority. Chariot, Queen of Pentacles, and the King of Swords is on your side. On their side, they have the Seven of wants the ace of swords again guys and we have the queen of cups again duplicate cards on the combined energy we have the two of cups we got the star again and we got the four of wands all right listen for those of you who want something to change and like for this to be quicker and I'm hearing like, can this go quicker? Can we like get this union going? Can we like get her happy on? I do hear that. I'm tired of just evaluating and nurturing on my own. Many of you might have that mother, you know, you might be a mother nurturing, like I said, or helping other people, but it's like, it feels like it's like you're constantly evaluating, evaluating what's stable in this relationship. Um, the queen or the king of swords is here. Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius energy, how you feel is like, when are they going to have a new perception? When are they going to tell me the truth? I want to hear the truth. I'm hearing, I want to hear the truth. Take off the mask. Take off the mask. Time to make me a priority. Now, this individual, what's happening here? Seven of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries energy. Listen. This is about having being defensive and having the upper hand. They are trying to knock out all of the stuff that no longer serves them or the other people who are juggling for their time, okay? They are trying to get to you. I feel that strongly. Yes, they, they are very clear that they need to, to take care of themselves, nurture themselves, and get over themselves. That's what I'm hearing. They are moving forward to you. We do have the Ace of Swords here. They want to speak the truth. They know that they owe you the truth. They know that they owe you more than just the truth, okay? They know that they owe you compassion, love, nurturing, queen of cups, how they see you again. They, they know that you've been waiting. They know that you deserve more. I just noticed that she's holding the, uh, the fish, you know, Pisces energy is like holding the fish. I never noticed that she was holding a fish on this card. But to me, that's almost like, you know how like, you know how on the traditional rider deck, the fish is in the cup or the page and she's pulling like it looks like she's pulling out the fish like I don't want any small offers this person knows they can't offer you small offers anymore they know they have to owe they owe you the big deal okay they know that they want it because this is a joint energy of nurturing they know that both of you know you need to nurture this relationship in order for it to work both of you do okay this is both your energy both of you are healing from the situation okay both of you I do feel this person is going to start making an effort. I'm hearing they're going to make an effort to nurture themselves, to take care of themselves so that they can nurture you and the family, but feel like make you a priority here, okay? Four of Wands, happiness, union. I'm hearing union. So I do feel like this person wants to, as much as you want this movement here, look, it's like, Oh my gosh, when are you gonna get on here and come movement? And it's like, oh, I'm coming. We're com I'm coming to pick you up and we're gonna have our happiness on. Some of them, they might actually be planning a, like, a not maybe not a getaway, but a special night for you, I'm hearing. Some of you might have a special night coming up or a special, like this person wants to do something special for you. Interesting. All right, Libra, if this uh, resonated for you, go ahead and hit like. Don't forget to comment below, and I will see you next time, all right? And subscribe as well. Take care.